Netflix's Chilling Adventures of Sabrina is heading into its second season, which drops on April 5th. Here today, we're going to go over just the first season and what has happened in it and get you all ready with everything you need to know to start season two. Here we go. A loose adaptation of the Archie horror comic series of the same name, Chilling Adventures of Sabrina follows high schooler Sabrina Spellman with her family and friends in the town of Greendale. The daughter of a deceased mortal woman and warlock, Sabrina is raised by her, by her aunts and her cousin Ambrose in the Spellman family mortuary on the outskirts of town. As Sabrina's 16th birthday approaches, she is fated to undergo a ritual known as the Dark Baptism and pledge her loyalty to the Dark Lord. A demon named Madam Satan kills and takes the form of Sabrina's favorite teacher, Miss Wardell, in an attempt to get closer to her. Sabrina leaves her high school and her mortal friends and boyfriend Harvey Kinkle to enroll in the Academy of Unseen Arts, where young witches and wizards train in the dark arts. Overseen by Father Blackwood, Sabrina is targeted by the Weird Sisters, a trio of cruel teenagers led by a young witch named Prudence while receiving the attention of fellow student Nicholas Scratch. After Harvey's older brother Tommy is killed in an accident caused by the Weird Sisters, Sabrina ventures into limbo to recover Tommy's soul after failing to put the Weird Sister Agatha's soul in his body to get revenge for Tommy's death. Failing this, Sabrina ventures into limbo with the help of Madam Satan to return Tommy's soul to his body, only to briefly encounter the soul of her mother before Tommy's soul is devoured by a soul eater. Forced to put down the undead incarnation of his brother after learning of Sabrina's supernatural heritage, Harvey ends their relationship. Using a blood sacrifice, Madam Satan summons the Greendale Thirteen, a coven of witches executed centuries ago. As the malevolent spirits wreak havoc on the town, the Spellmans cast a protection spell on Greendale while Sabrina signs the Book of the Beast, pledging herself to the Dark Lord at Madam Satan's urging so that she can gain the power to banish the Greendale Thirteen for good. As Sabrina vanquishes the evil spirits, Lord Blackwood's wife gives birth to twins, but she dies in childbirth. Sabrina's Aunt Zelda keeps the daughter for herself after carrying on an illicit affair with Blackwood during the pregnancy. Finally, Madam Satan quietly reveals her master plan to become the Dark Lord's Queen instead of Sabrina. As the holidays come to Greendale, Harvey and Sabrina still quietly pine for each other, but insist on remaining single for each other's sake, while Sabrina maintains her distance from her mortal friends. After narrowly defeating a demon with the help of the ghost of Sabrina's mother, Zelda decides that the Spellman household is just too dangerous to secretly raise Lord Blackwood's daughter and entrust her to an outcast witch living deep in the bordering Greendale. With Sabrina having signed the Book of the Beast, she's now under the Dark Lord's direct influence as teased by the trailer where she is apparently ready to set fire to her old high school while under his sway. Still single, it appears Sabrina will be more receptive to Nick's romantic advances, while Harvey does his best to win back his ex-girlfriend, making the love triangle perhaps the emotional crux of Season 2 as Valentine's Day comes to Greendale. So there you have it guys, just a quick overview of Season 1 and what you'll need to know to get ready for Season 2. Like I said, before it drops on April 5th, I'm really excited about it. Uh, we'll be going through some recaps of the episodes, you know, one by one. So stick around for that if you're interested. And be sure and like and subscribe to the channel for more information. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.